What's going on guys? Wade with Wade's Ventures here and yet another storage unit unboxing guys. So this is a storage unit that we did yesterday and that footage will be up tomorrow, which if you're watching this will be up Sunday. This will be up Monday if you're watching this. Guys, this is a lot of stuff. Brought it into the house. We're gonna show one box at a time, kind of like what we do with the other storage units. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to this channel right below the video. Subscribe, hit the little bell icon because we do a lot of storage units, a lot of dumpster dives. This year and next year is going to be huge for this channel. So we're going to dig into this. We're going to do a box at a time. Some of these boxes we have not dug through. If you guys know what some of this stuff is, put it in the comments because I'm clueless. Um, I sell Nike clothes. I don't do a lot of hard goods. So if you know what's in here, let me know. Let's dig into this. We got mom, got Ashley here. The two babies are gonna help us out with this. And uh, hopefully you guys like this stuff. Those of you who don't know, it was a 10 by 12 unit, which is kind of an odd unit. And uh, it was bought off storage treasures. And this was a um, second opportunity, guys. So the, the storage facility called me, or storage treasures did, called me because the first two bidders did not pay. And uh, so I was the third, third opportunity, guys. Paid 400 bucks. Hopefully we can get our 400 bucks back, guys. All right, let's do this, first box. All right, box number one, let's do this. We got a tea kettle, this was in this box. No particular order, guys. Remember, 400 bucks, we gotta get this money back. Um, we got a cool angel. And um, it, it's not, it feels like just a China angel, so. All right, we got this. I think these are vintage golf club. They go over your golf clubs, guys. I've got a few of these in some of the other boxes. And a really cool wire basket. Some of this stuff isn't worth a lot in this box. Remember, no particular order, but there was some really cool stuff over there. Um, this thing is messed up. So. And, <laughs> but anyways, let's keep going. All right. We have an old chess and checkers set, guys. An old one. All right. Remember, any family stuff, stuff like that, that is going to back to the unit, uh, the facility, then contact. We got some cool, I think these are motorcycle or um, motocross gloves. So I don't know much about it, but those actually may sell decent on eBay. Wow. What is that? We have a ton of watches in here. Um, a ton of watches. Let me see if I can move the camera so you guys can get a better look at this stuff. All right, so let's see what we got going on here, guys. So a bunch of watches. I'll have to go through these things. I don't know a lot about watches. Ooh, Winnie the Pooh. Um, so a bunch of watches, guys. Put those over there. What is in here? Oh, these are vintage drills. That's kind of cool. Wow, look at that. They're not all there, but that's really cool. This was an older unit, guys. They had, I mean, a lot of that stuff was older. All right, wow, look at this. Mate, look at this massive mace. Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. Look how big that thing is, wow. Um, it's got mace in it <laughs> from 1981. Wow. So, can you imagine getting mace from 1981 mace? That may be worth money. Who knows? Who knows? We got some angels. They don't look like anything too special. But. All right. Let's see what else we got in here. Oh, wow. Look at this, guys all those watches I mean they may be cheaper watches but there is a ton in here guys there's a ton Wow that's incredible so we'll go through these and see what we have uh, may have some good ones in there who knows who knows the guy definitely collected watches Wow <laughs> can you believe that more watches I don't know a lot about watches, so if you guys know anything about watches, let me know. 
but I don't know how many there. Probably over 100 watches. Here's another one. Wow, that's kind of cool. So another one. So more more watches in here, guys. More watches. What else do we have? Looks like nothing in here besides paper or a couple stones. This is just a rag. What the heck? We had to remember this was in the video? Yeah, I don't know what what those are, are these things? Here, let's see if we can focus one on the screen. They're like little glass KKCs or something. I don't know what these things are. You guys know, let me know. But there's a ton of them in here. So. And let me know if they're worth any money. Alright. Some old hats. We have a heat massager salon thing, and it's in there. So. Okay, that works. We have an empty cigar case. Ooh, it smells like cigars. Ooh, a lot of wallets. Oh, personal stuff is going back to the storage unit, guys. But the wallets all sell. An old calculator. HP. That's really cool. It actually may be worth money. I don't know, though. I want to check on that. Oh, this was cool. We found this, remember? The... Mm -hmm translator so you got all those different languages you can translate some more wallets this one is Christian Delore looks pretty good condition some more wallets so let's check on those what is in here Ooh, jewelry! Mom, we got jewelry over here. We just gotta see if it's real. We got a we got a gold kit, so we'll pull this and see if it's real. Uh, but you get, you do get gold, real gold. So we'll see. We may have already paid for the units. Ooh, wow. coin! Nice. Oh, I like those. Yes. Um, Austrian coins. They're in there too. Are that's, there others too? That's awesome. Um, no, no coins in here. This is just a um, made in the United States It'd be fun to get a pocket day timer. I don't know, but yeah, there's coins in there. Mint. All right. What's in here? Oops, we have some glasses, and they're actually the glasses that are in there. What brand is it? So. No, no. This is a safe. This is a red rocket. Oh, you see, safety I can't system. See. Yeah. What does it do? Remove cap. Bottom. Hold. So it looks like yeah. Fire comes out of it or something. Is it a flare? It's a flare. Yeah, emergency flare. Yeah, and maybe from 1980. So we'll get rid of that thing. Uno, guys. Um, we have some personal pictures in here, so we'll give those back to the uh, the facility. That's Ooh, a cute this is from um, Portland, Oregon, which is where we're at. We did get a firework, so let's do that. And battery, so nothing else in here, guys. Another battery. So this is the first box. Let's go to the next box. All right, box number two, guys. Let's do this. So I got an Xbox 360. Um, I don't know exactly how much these things are worth, but um, this will help towards the 400. So we'll put this guy over here. All right. This is personal stuff. We're going to give this back to the facility, and they can contact the family. We have a purse, XOXO. I don't know many of these brands, to be honest, but we do have some purses here. All right, we have a vintage uh, Mickey backpack. This is kind of cool, huh? That is cool. That is really cool. 
Disney. And it's, um, it's Disney, so that's kind of cool. We'll clean that bad boy up. Ooh! Here is the uh, pedals for that Xbox 360. I, I don't know how much this thing's gonna go for, but we'll take a look at it. All right, I got some random stuff in here that I don't know if it's worth any money. Just China toys. Ooh, we have some controllers, guys. I love selling controllers. Remote controls. Yep, I love selling remote controls. Some pennies. Oh, these are 1960 pennies. Wow, that will go with my collection. All right, mom, you want to show them inside the box? We have just a bunch of toys in here. I think these are um, probably going to go to Cade, more than likely. Ooh, anybody play with rockets? <laughs> like... They build rockets. Yeah. We used uh, to do that. So just a bunch of random toys in here, guys. We're going to have to uh, let Cade play with some of these. Ooh. I like compasses. Old. If they work. <laughs> yes. Um, what are these things, though? These are kind of cool. I'll have to figure that out, but... All right, guys, we'll go on to the next box and um, buy just a bunch of toys, guys. Box number three, guys. Let's get into this. This box is pretty mangled. Let me mangle it more with my man hands, all right? All right, so we have some personal stuff in here. I don't know if you guys can see, but um, I'll have to go through this. Personal stuff is gonna go back to the facility. Ooh, that's something sticky on it. Okay. It's a fanny, like a little bit of fanny pack. It's vintage. It's older. Pretty cool. Another backpack, guys. Put those. We'll sell those. I've never seen that emblem before. Is that a computer bag? Looks like. Uh, yeah, it's an older one now. Gray. And this looks like a golf bag. Mr. Roberts. Pretty cool. Maybe it's a golf bag. Ooh, this is new. It's an older photo album. Still sealed. Some people like the older ones. Mm -hmm. Cool rainbow. From Maui. Yeah. Some people like that. People like bright colors, you know? Like this purple here. You got to look through every single thing, though. You never know if there's money in there, guys. Never know. Never know if there's money. Here's a Myron Frank bag. <laughs> Old bag. And another bag here. Pretty beat up. Nothing on this one here. Know, that's a bag box. <laughs> yes, this is a bag box. This guy is pretty good condition. Um, really good condition, actually. This is probably a golf bag, maybe. So, here's another photo. Oh, it's got personal photos. These are going to go back to the facility. Got another, yep, personal photos. Here's another fanny pack. Those things are in right now, but this is a little crusty. <laughs> but fanny pack. Uh, okay, a bunch of, bunch of uh, VHS tapes. Uh-oh, we have a bunch of old Playboys in here. We also have a massage works. It's all there. So I may have to sell this. It's an old massager, guys. We'll see how much that thing's worth. So that's a keeper. VHS is no. Um, and then we have a bunch of old Playboys here. Did we're you gonna, sell? Could you sell them all yes, the time? we're gonna 1980s Playboys. So those will sell. And some more. All right, on to box number four. Box number four. Let's dig into this. Oh, this is a mug box. And this one, there's a lot of these that are already broken, so I have to be really careful. Here's an old Starbucks made in Taiwan. 
Wow, exclusively for Starbucks. So that's kind of cool. Let me get out of the camera so it focuses. Old Starbucks mug sell, guys. Let's see, where's the date on this thing? It doesn't have a date. It just says number one. Number one of a series. Yeah, and it's old. Made out in Taiwan, so you th you'd think it's probably pretty old, right? It'd be nice if you have number two and three and four. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, well that's, that's a keeper. Alright. Snowflake. I don't know what brand that is. Oh, you gotta be careful with some of these. Alright, we're in here. The Galaxy VIP collection. Ooh, Mercedes Benz. This actually may sell. Uh, Mercedes Benz. So we'll try to we'll try to hurry throughout this, guys, because there's a lot. Oh, no. Okay, this is good. This is just a random cup. Nothing going on here. All right, all right. Let's see here. Can we get some more Starbucks mugs? Ashley may keep them all, huh, Ashley? The World Market, nothing too special, guys. Just the World Market, but kind of cool. All right, we have uh, Forever of Friends. Just a random one here. Oh, that one's still not going in. And here's another one of those snowflake, probably just random made in China ones. So not bad so far. Here's another random, not worth much. Bi ink made in China. I don't know. I'll have to, I'll have to see. Here's another one of those snowflake ones. Ooh, wow, this stuff is not wrapped up really well. Here's a best dad cup, guys. And here's another random one here. Hopefully those are focusing. Come on, Starbucks. We need more Starbucks. Here's just another main Korea Russ Barbie and Co. Just a kind of a sane mug here. And oh, we got another Starbucks, honey. Wow, is this the same one? This is the same one we had before. What's the number on the bottom? It says number one. So if that focuses. Let me see if I get out of the screen here. That's so funny. Anyways. Let's see, some glass in here. Oh, do we have another one? We have another one. The same exact one, guys. Same exact one. Let's see if it'll focus. Come on, focus on the mug. There we go. Okay. This camera does not want to focus. Here's just kind of a, I think this is like a sugar or something bowl here. This is the top board. So we have three of those same exact Starbucks mugs. That's awesome. The big guy, Palm Springs. Here's another world market here. All right, we're getting to the nitty gritty here. Oh man, this China. They did not package the China. Wow, look at that. That one completely busted. Look at this though. Wow. It's kind of cool. But it has like a little... It's weird. There's no way you can set it down. There's that. This china is not broken. Harmony House. China. Fine China Harmony House. So... At least that's not broken. Look at this though. Man, I completely just... This one here. Castle Court Fine China, made in Japan. This one's not broken, so that's good. There's some more that's not broken. Some more and some more, so that's good. Kind of heavy. That's good. 
see. This guy's not broken. I can't read out the name on this one. Virginia Ross, made in the United States. So that's not broken. Just a cool another coffee mug. Another Palm Springs, obviously Palm Springs is a thing. And we have um, a creamer right here. Oops, gotta be careful, there's glass in here. Tigger, but this, this thing is uh, made in Taiwan. It's an older Tigger. Kids, kids, uh, bowl. Some more. China here, so that's kind of cool. Looks like just more China, guys. Ooh, Winnie the Pooh! Winnie the Pooh, this is a vintage Winnie the Pooh. So maybe I'll lock those up on eBay. So we'll see on that. Here's another China plate, another China plate. All right, guys, so this is it. I think the biggest thing is the Starbucks mugs. Um, that is the biggest thing is the three Starbucks mugs. So let's continue to rock here. Go on to box number five. Show you the good, the bad, the ugly. Let's make this happen. Ooh, new in the box, never used, Chuck. So there's three of them in here, okay. I'm actually sorting this stuff. Sellable, donatable, and skivable while I'm doing this with you guys. So that's the outside cement. Yes, we'll Cable keep like <laughs> We'll keep this chuck. We also have a book. A <laughs> a poodle dish. <laughs> no, I think it's a a tiny toy poodle dish. <laughs> okay, this is obviously for your needles, guys. So, yeah, let's toss that. And, oh, I think that was just one of the sex things, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I think they're diabetic, that's what it is. Some random stuff, guys. All right, more chalk. Oh, more nice. chalk sealed. That's actually a good find. And, and this chalk is not sealed, but it's still be used. So it looks like this is an easy box number five, guys. This is for the kids. Bunch of sealed chalk. So let's go on to the next box. All right, box number six. This one's got a bunch of random stuff in it. This is kind of cool. It's an old Japan. It has Japan on it. Oh yeah, for earrings. On the back, so I don't know. For earrings. It's got so that's kind of cool. We'll keep that. We have an HP little scanner. You can scan documents with this thing. And then we have looks like a bunch of we have some ink cart an ink cartridge. Some looks like photo paper in here. This is a oh we're going to give this back to the facility. Um, remember guys, any personal stuff goes back to the facility. We have a uh, BB gun. So, just some random stuff in here. I'm gonna keep this. Tape measure can never, ooh, we have an old doll, mom. You may know about this. What brand is it? I don't know, it's porcelain. Oh yeah, it's a collector's doll. She's kind of. We'll have to look at the markings. Yeah. I'll have to see if there's any markings. I like too. the little one. Yeah. Uh, let's get some of this out of here. Just kind of some random CDs, paper, stuff like that. We'll have to go through that and make sure there's no money. Yeah. Oh, an old. Uh, you guys remember Barney? Old Barney book. Oh yeah. Another kid book. Which is kind of cool. All right, it's not much else in here, guys. You get a lot of this like randomness with storage units. They get a cool 
cross stitch. Cross stitch picture. That's why we have a grandma in the house. Tell us what. <laughs> if, if we don't know, you guys know. A bunch of CDs. So. Maybe some games. Yeah, maybe some games. So not else much in this box, guys. Um. Wow, this is kind of cool. What it's is like, it? It's got like little sayings on here. Like, Are about say fun? something. Oh, it's a journal jar. Oh yeah, you write things and put it in there. Huh. All right, well, let's go on to the next box, guys. Next box, box number seven. Let's do this, number seven. By the way, before we get into this box, boom, got these big old boys. Super soakers. I know some of these can go for some good money. This was in the storage unit. And it has all the caps to it as well. This is a big one, guys. The super soaker, so um, it has all the caps to it. So I don't know exactly how much these things are gonna go for, but got two of them, guys. So that's good. All right, let's get into this. Box number seven? Yep, seven. All right, everybody loves clothes. You're gonna love these. So old Levi's, these things go for some good money. They got the red, um, the red tag back here. But old Levi's, these are distressed, but they're in decent condition. So I'll sell the heck out of these things. And I can list them all in one day just by hanging these things up. I'll hang them up right there and take pictures of them. So here's another pair of Levi's. Woo -wee! I put this in the video, guys. We got vintage Tommy. Tommy jeans, these are gonna be nice. These are gonna sell nice. These are white too. So, these are gonna sell really well. And then I got another pair here of the navy blue Tommies. And they're 3430s, so they're kind of a common size for men. Another Levi's. Hopefully we have some more Tommy jeans in here. That was a killer find, huh? That paid for a good portion of our unit right there. Um, paid for a good portion of the unit right there. Okay, what do we got here? Ooh, we have some Polo Ralph Lauren. Ooh, these are vintage Hong Kong. Ooh, there we go. This is going to pay for some of the unit right here. So, this is a good box. Man, this thing's full. This thing is full. It's more Levi's. That's in a better condition, though. So, well, man, we got all kinds of stuff here. Oh, we have Guess jeans. These are made in the U.S. Vintage. So that's good. Gonna make some money with this unit. All right, some more polo right there. There's a lot of them in here. Wow. We didn't go through all these. We have some other Levi's here. We didn't go through all these in the unit, so I don't know exactly what's in here. It was cold, huh? <laughs> oh, This is the uh, Armani Exchange. A pair of Armani Exchange jeans. Some more Levi's. Let's do this. Let's go. Ooh, here we go. Here's our third pair of Tommies. Third pair of Tommies. Wow. This is gonna pay for some of the unit right here. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh. I always say this wrong. D cell or whatever. Anyways, those are not cheap, but one of the more expensive jeans in here. Alright, some more of those. We have a t-shirt. Wow. That is interesting. Is it? What is this? Oh, okay. No, no, okay, this is just a newer newer t-shirt, nothing special. Alright. South Pole. I don't know if these are really old or not. I don't think so. These are new. South Pole's new because it's from 1991, so... I don't think those are really old. Another pair. I mean, they could be older. I don't know exactly how old, though. Are they short or jeans? Oh, those are jeans. Here's another pair. You can tell. Ooh, these are in really good condition, though. Wow. Look at that, guys. Look at the condition it's in. 
So three pairs of those. So three pairs of those. Polo, Ralph Lauren's. We also have a hitch. Put this on your hitch. On the back of your truck. We have some candles and that's it guys. This is a massive box. This thing is crazy. It's gonna bring some good money. I'm super excited. Three Tommies, three po uh, uh, South Pole, whatever those things are called. And um, I don't sell a lot of these. And so some Ralph Lauren, so. And, and Levi's, ton of Levi's, so. All right guys, let's go on to the next box. Hopefully it's just as good. What's going on my peeps? <laughs> This is, uh, mom, are you keeping track? This is number eight. Number eight, dude. We crushed it with the jean box. Paid for the unit, $400 easy with that one box. So let's continue. All right. Ooh, this is an old California mug. Rainbow. Nothing but rainbows in California, huh? Okay. We didn't go through, ooh, this is cool, mom. Dude. Look at this. Ooh. And it's got the little cup. Is that from Japan? It is, made in Japan. Yeah, there, there's a name for those. I don't know, it's some yeah, sort Yeah, they have a special name. Japan. If you guys know what this is, let me know. Um, I couldn't go through any of this in the Unix, so just, you didn't wanna. Here's an old Reno. That's mom's favorite. Made in place. England. Made in England? <laughs> Reno? That's odd. Oh, this is kind of cool. An old card card box. Cool. All right. This is a um, little pistol mug. That's cool. Palm Springs, like he loved Palm Springs. This is Maine, Korea. <laughs> Palm Springs mug, Maine, Korea. <laughs> interesting seen is believing 1983 Pacific Northwest Conference AA Oregon so, oh it's, you put your change in it can we get some more just a cool suns and moons, suns and and moons mug. this is blood crystal Light crystal. It's kind of heavy, actually. The lighter ones are the ones that are worth a lot of money. Here's another palm, obviously from Palm Springs. Another Palm Springs mug. So. Oh, we know these are popular. Anything with the chicken. <laughs> Made in Indonesia, I think. I don't know. I can't read it. It's uh, anything with chickens, guys. Little tip: anything with chickens sell. People love the chickens. Looks like this is a handmade one, probably. Oh, another lead crystal. It's kind of heavy. Okay. From Texas with love. From Texas with love. Oh, you gotta be careful with this one. Yeah, oh, there's the lid. Be a lid somewhere. There's another one of those with no lid though, so it's probably in here. They didn't package this stuff really they're good. They're urns, but they're, they're a special name for them. Yeah. And those that are wondering, because I got a lot of questions when this paper was, um, like when, how old the paper was. 1997 is the paper, guys. So what, 20 something years ago, North Dakota. Cool. That's her grandma was born. This is gonna be another lead. Another lead. So Oops, Starbucks. It's the same one. So we have, you have a set of four, that's good. We have four of these now. <laughs> wow. We have four of these. Wish we could find the other in the series, but we have a set of four. Yeah. Caring volunteer mug. Oh, here's another lead crystal. This is light. 
Oh, is this a German mug? Oh, this is cool. What is that? <laughs> this is cool. It's a golfing mug. Look. Oh, a golfer would love that. Yeah. <laughs> we'll wow. sell them with the golf clubs. <laughs> N.A. Fastman? I don't know what that means. N.A. Fastman? I don't even know if I'm saying that right, but... That would be really cool. We have an Airlines mug. An old Airlines mug. 747. Yep. Okay, here we go. This is a um, crystal made from France. You guys can see that. Right there. So this is probably the set that I've been pulling out. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have a lot of light crystal. That's the beautiful thing about doing storage units. Like, you get really expensive stuff. Yeah. Here's another one. With it's kind of a pretty design, too. Yeah. They look better when they're all sparkly. Yep. Here's another one. I know some of the more expensive stuff comes from Ireland. Um, okay. Got a mug. Got another one of those boot mugs. With the cowboy boots. It's kind of cool. Glass. That one does not have the sticker on it. Happy birthday. Got some random ones and then some cool ones, you know? Oh, here's another one. You're gonna have a full set of that. Yep. I may have to keep those, they're actually kind of nice. Made in Italy. Just a random one made in That's Italy. That's a cool one. Yeah. I like the ones with the weird pictures. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. I don't know how to say this. Is it Pyrex? <laughs> P Y R E X. Or Pyrex. Well, how do you or, say it? I'm not saying. Or is it Plex? Pyrex <laughs> or Plex? Can you guys let me know, guys? But yeah, I got some of that. <laughs> Up oh, running out of air, real estate here. Here's some Pyrex or Plex. Or Plex. <laughs> I just don't know how to pronounce it. It's Pyrex. Is it Pyrex? I'm thinking so. Just a random. A blue pan. Blue pan? Grandma needs more pan. All right, that's it. I think we did well on this one. Let's go to number nine. Let's do this. It's nine. Number nine. Oh, gloves? Man, I was missing a pair of gloves when I was at the storage unit. <laughs> so now I have a pair of gloves. I don't want to see any comments saying I don't have any gloves. Even I'm, if they are gardening. <laughs> I'm just joking. Oh, this is an adult. This is adult cards, guys. Can't show them, but they're um, uh, the Dollhouse of America. There is adult cards like that? Yes, they're all adult. I never do that. Wow. Somebody will buy them. All right, so we have another Ooh, cigar. I like that box. Cigar. Still smells Ooh. like cigars. Okay, we have cigar this. Time. Yes. Wow, we have a lot of stuff in here. Ooh, these will sell. I love getting stuff that's still new in the package. Um, so those will sell. In fact, let me pull up my old eBay app and just see if they will sell, shall we? All right. Let's scan this bad boy. And we'll go solds. Yep, this took care, this sold on the fifth for 20 bucks. So this right here is 120 uh, bucks down on my storage unit, just one item. So that's cool. Oh, it's not in here, guys. This is a... Uh, there's a lot of these in here. What is this? Okay, this is just a power... A power um, cord here. Some of these do sell, so you'll have to take a look at those. Um, we already went through a little bit of this with the storage unit. 
Got some keys here. Oh, that doesn't open. It's a cool little box though. It's a musical box. Oh, it's a Swiss musical uh, box. Made and in Switzerland. That makes it nicer. A Swiss music. I wonder what song it is. Uh, I don't want to break it, but it's not moving. Yeah, it may be broken. Okay. What is in here? I couldn't go through a lot of this at the storage unit because, um, oh, these are old business cards. Okay. Um, okay. So old business cards, guys, not worth anything. Oops, thought I were here for now. This is a miscellaneous box, Mom. Got a bunch of stuff in it. Wireless. Oh, it's not even in there. Okay. Um, test kit. So, oh, this is a mold test kit. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it is cool. Just to make sure you have no mold. Let's stick into this guy. Ooh, Rolex. See, I'm wondering, I've never sold one of these. I'm wondering if like just this Rolex box will sell. I bet it would without anything. Like I bet somebody would want to buy just this. So I'm going to check on that. And I even have this with the, the box. So I'm going to keep that nice. Um, there's some, a lot of loose. We have, probably have what? 150 yeah. watches, 150. A lot to go through. So we have a lot of watches to go through. All right, so let's dig into this. Let's, let's dig into this and figure out what the heck we got. Got another watch. Too many to count how many watches we have. A lot of empty jewelry. So let's start getting some of this paper out here. It's odd they kept all that. Yeah. We have a keychain mount on your wall. Birthday stars and numbers. <laughs> I used to have that book <laughs> years ago in yeah. high school. We got some more wallets, an old Blackberry case. Those do sell still. Phone case. Wow, this thing has just got everything in it you can think of. But he obviously like collected watches. Maybe he worked somewhere where people lost a bunch of watches. And then, um, and then, um, you know, just maybe they went to him or something. I don't know. This is an old notebook case here. All right, what do we got? Nothing, nothing. Ooh, we have a Nintendo DS game. Ah, it's not in there. Darn. I'll keep it though, just in case we kind of run across it. Um, wow. Orgasm over a hundred truly explosive tips. TMI, TMI. We have a lot of coin. You know, you put your coins in there, like little cases in here. So. Coin collector would buy those. Yeah. Ooh, a whole cuff set is in here, guys. Wow, that's cool. I don't know what kind, of, what the brand is. It doesn't have anything on there. It may not be worth much money. But that's in there. Let's see. Got a bunch of like um, ibuprofen, pain relief stuff in there. Probably no good. Oh, look at this, a Leatherman knife. Made in the, oh, I needed a knife. <laughs> Seriously, this is perfect. Now I can open the boxes at the storage units, guys. Man, that is just great. Ooh, we have some plates in Ooh, here. Ooh, pretty one. This was marked 32 bucks back in the day. It was made in um, England. And got a bunch of those. So that's cool. Somebody may need a set. Another watch. Ooh, this is a Tommy watch. Hilfiger, a vintage Tommy Hilfiger watch. Wow. It's not going anymore, but you can barely see that. Maybe it needs a battery. It might need a battery. Wow. <laughs> I don't know if Tommy watches are going for a good amount of money. Oh, we have some old silverware, guys. And it's old. What's it say? Uh, community? Community? Old community silverware? 
So what is this, Mom? Like 1930s? I don't know. I'm oh, not... this is, sorry, this is Roger and Son? Roger and Son. Oh. Well, does it, is it stainless or is it... I don't, it looks stainless. It's all in here, though. I don't it's know. It's old. It's old. You can see, you know, I don't know exactly. That's interesting. You just never know what you'll find in these units, right? Um, what is this? What is this? And, oh, this is a, this is an old, like, Ooh, shaving knife yes, kind of is. thing. Wow. Oh, that's scary. And it's still sharp. Wow. And it still has the case for it, too. That's a little an paper. Antique. Yeah. Look at that. Wow. Hopefully, it's not too blurry for you guys. This is random. So much random. Up some more watches in here, guys. A lot more watches. I'm trying not to have this box go too long, but. Um, bunch of stuff in here. We're gonna have to go through all this. We have a Gucci. I'm wondering if this Gucci case will sell for something, just the case alone. They like the finer things in here, huh? An old Rolex. Maybe he was a watch repair person. That makes sense, because he likes like old stuff, right? Yeah. Um, he definitely has a lot of watches. Yeah. I'm trying to think if there's anything else in here worth and in showing. Everything. Some more watches. Some batteries that are no good. No good batteries. So, Alright guys. That's a really old watch. I don't know. Let's see. Anyways, we'll have to look at these watches to see if they're worth anything. Ooh, this one feels like there's something in here. Maybe it's just the case? Ooh, it's in there. One year warranty. Oh, it's not the watch that's in. Oh, yeah, it is. How do you pronounce that, Mom? Let me see. Can you see it? <laughs> That's a... Genevex? Genevex? Is that how you say it? I think so. Genevex. All right. Genevex. Okay. It's in there. Oh, we better keep that. I think this is a good one. All right, let me see it. I like it. Is there another one? It's actually in there. Genevex watch. And the one in your hand, is that in there? No, that's the case oh. for it. All right, guys. That's it for this box. I don't want to go too long on it, but you can see... Bunch of just random stuff in here, so we'll go through it until box number 10. All right, see you there. Box number 10, box number 10. Let's go through this, guys. So we have a, um, looks like an old music book. Box number 10. Another cigar. Romeo and Juliet. Romeo and Juliet. Oh, it, nice it doesn't smell like cigars anymore. Another book. Guys, I'm showing you the good, the bad, the ugly. Okay? Not just not just selective. Not just, I'm like literally pulling. Now this is really cool. We pulled this out of the storage unit. It's an old um, camel tin. But get this. This was so cool. So it has the um, the old matches and it's sealed. Camel matches. Camel matches. Now you gotta be a little careful. You can't ship this stuff a lot of times. So I may have to sell this local because you can't ship matches. So the matches are in those old tins. I never knew Yeah. That. So that it's brand new. And get this. Look at this guy. People collect the crap out of this thing. But guys, I put this on the video. These are old lighters. They're, they're the old lighters. lighters. They collected them. So, um, that's really cool. And they're all empty. So I can ship these. They don't have anything. Oh, <laughs> I lied. <laughs> okay, they're not all empty. Look at this, though. Look at that. Isn't that's that cool? cool? It's still got the. Oh, let's not burn my finger off. 
Ah, uh, it doesn't work. Okay. Anyways, that's worth some money right there. I think. I don't know. I haven't sold any of those, but we're just gonna say it's worth some money. All right. Ooh, he that's sells a nice the tech. Bucket from Prince's house. Twenty-five bucks. That is a Prince's house design. Yes. All right. Let's move into some more stuff here. Oh, we have old playing cards. Wow, this is awesome. Oh, it's a game. Sorry. It's an old game. So it's a dice game. It's a dice game. Isn't that awesome? So that's really cool. What is this, mom? Is this old princess too? Um, uh, that doesn't it's look etched. like princess house, but it is etched crystal. Is it depression? Maybe. Okay, let's see what else we got. Endless love, but it's not in there. <laughs> we have some cassettes in here, guys. Um, nothing else in there, just old cassettes. Woo -wee. Look at this. A camel hat, an old camel hat. Dude, we're gonna crush it on this unit, guys. That Seriously. camel hat is cool, too. What is in here? So this is cool. It's a, a tin piece. Camel powder. Yeah, and then you lift this up. Is that the roll your own kind of cigarettes? Um, I, no. And then it just has a bunch of camel sealed matches in here. So they were never used. So obviously they're collecting camel stuff, right? We have Corvette. I don't know if this is worth money or not. Yeah. Just says Corvette 1913. Oh, it's made in Japan. So they're not newer. Um, I think it's probably a series. And it says Japan. Well, here's another one. This one says Japan here too. So there's two Are of they them. Cologne bottles? No, there's, this one has a hole in it. It doesn't oh. have the felt. There's so nothing there's nothing. I mean, there's a hole. Oh, maybe they're maybe so. there is holes here, but yeah, they're made in Japan. So that's really cool. For a car this is sealed. What's in here? It's made in Hong Kong, and it's a sealed camel. It's yeah, probably. Used to make little cigars. Was it for little cigars? You think? I think it might be little cigars. <laughs> okay, this is personal. All right, guys. Let's go on to the next box. Boom, ba 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 number 11. Okay. So this we put in the storage unit video. Just a sealed toy, but it's from Big Lots. So nothing special, but we'll give it to the kids. And we have some old door handles. I'm probably gonna, somebody probably is gonna say, those are worth money, but I don't know. Let me know in the comments, guys. We'll put them order for now. Uh, some plastic drop cloth. I'll keep that. Man, these things are beat up. These are old shoes. Um, they're old Air Max. So, I'm still gonna try to clean those up. This is really cool, guys. That is cool. Look at this thing. And it has, um, has on the back, I know every silver is different, but this one says 979. It's Rogers. So Rogers Co. So I'm gonna have to see, you know, how much this thing's worth. That is so unique. But it's really unique. Some drywall patch. Even the baby is excited. We have, I can always use these. These are just paint rollers. Um, so we have some paint brushes, guys. Some more paint brushes. Kind of a household box, I think. Here's the other shoe. The baby's got a lot to say. Oh, this is uh, in the package. Kind of cool. There's some spark plugs. We have a flashlight, corroded batteries. Um, some more paint brushes. Some more spark plugs. These are older spark plugs though. So I may actually see if they sell. And it looks like a puzzle. Some more spark plugs. Let's see what's in here. Oh yeah, these are new. So 
And they've got barcodes on them. Really? Okay. Some wall repair tape. And a, that's <laughs> an old shoe. <laughs> so, all right. On to box number 12. All right, guys, so get this. We found also in the storage unit a, a six month old baby. That's nobody. Uh, you want to smile? You want to smile? We have a six month old baby. Okay. All right. All right, so get this. These, this one's brand new. Um, this was found in the storage unit, guys. And this has never been used, still got the wrapping on it. It basically is a, um, it goes on the, on the snow. So I haven't looked these things up yet, but they may actually pay for the units. Um, so I've got two of these, one brand new, and then this one here that almost looks virtually brand new. So I don't know if you guys can see that. But two of these, they actually may, I don't know, they, they look spendy, so. Found those things in the unit, may pay for it, who knows. All right, let's go on with the box number 12, 11? I lost count, anyway. I think it's 11. All right, let's do this. Let's move these things. So I got two of these snow sled looking things. And... they called snow jacks. We also have some more snow jacks. Some more cigar cases, guys. Oh, that's kind of a nice one. This is a really nice one. Look at that. Ooh. So, got felt on the Monte, back. Monte Cristo. Monte Cristo. Monte Cristo. So, we'll keep all those. Somebody may want those. We have another one here. And. A few cigars. No, they're not in there. Oh. Somebody wanted five bucks for it, so he actually paid, he or she paid five bucks. There's another one. Right. And that's it. Um, that's it, just literally packing in here with peanuts and stuff, so. All right, let's go on to the next box, but pretty cool. All right, all right, box 13 and 14. I just did two smaller boxes, so let's see what we got. We got a fiberglass helmet. I don't know how much these things go for. Sorry, I just washed my hands. But um, got one of these bad boys. Fiberglass, I don't know, can they be cheap? I don't know, it looks like a nice one. So really cool. There's no markings on it, but it's wood. I think a candle sat on this, probably. Yes. Um, and we got a, um, some gospel books here, so that's cool. A payout form. And we also got a lot of this. It's made out of China, it's newer, not much money in it, but something maybe local, somebody would want it, because it's a full set, basically. So, I'll probably put that on local, guys. It's got a napkin holder here. Um, heat pad, put your pots, pots down on that. We have um, another piece here, and then a bowl. Very patriotic, I like it. Another plate, another, obviously needed a lot of napkins. So, and that's about it for this box. Just some VHSs. All right, let's go on to the next one here. So this one has the creepy doll. <laughs> like porcelain, um, but this is what's creepy. Look at that hairline, that's worse than me. <laughs> <laughs> um, Maybe we can get her a hat. Get her a hat, yeah. <laughs> but, so, I don't know. It's old. It's definitely old. Mom, you want to see it? Yeah. Doesn't even look happy. <laughs> it doesn't. Look at that face. No. 
Like, make the doll happy. Oh, and it's sitting. Um, some of these. Oh, the hair is kind of dirty. Oh, some empty, empty stuff. You find a lot of this. Um, here's kind of a cool. Oh, it's peeling something. All right, let's see. We have some lotions here. So that's cool. They look uh, virtually not used, which is nice. Some more lotion here. A lot of lotion. Looks like a just a random uh, flower base. Let's see what else we got in here. Some VHSs. Oh, these are kind of cool. These are shower gels. Are they shower gels? Mm -hmm. All right. What is this? Oh, this is just an old, what is it? Like just an old? They crocheted on it. Uh, you old hang crocheted. it on your towel rack and stick something in it, I guess. This kind of, kind of looks like Felton or whatever that stuff is, but it's not. Oh, oh yes. That's a good. That's a good movie. All right, let's see, what else do we got in here? A bunch of VHSs, I won't bore you with that, guys. Um, looks like some computer parts. Some more lotions. So a lot more lotions, guys. Samples. Samples, probably. This is kind of cool. So, more lotions. Now, what do we have in here? Oh, some, just some computer discs and that. And some Hallmark cards. Are they old ones? Um, some are used, some are not. Oh. Some of those ones go back to the facility. All right, let's continue. Boom! I'm right with you guys. Sorry, our dog Zora was planning his escape. Got out, went down like 20 houses, and we finally caught him. Thank goodness. That was crazy. Um, all right, so let's go to the next box. Wow, there's not much here, guys, but get this. What is this? These are all um, first aid kits. Like for old first aid kits. A motor, they're for cars, a motor pool. But get this though, they're all sealed, never used. How nice. Like you see the shine, the plastic is still on there. They've got the gloves, everything, like the gauze kit, everything is in here sealed. Um, so that's the thing is, I would imagine these would sell since they're brand new and they have the contents in them, right? I mean, look at this, they're all, they haven't been used. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Um, this one's even got the scissors. So, I don't know guys. We should be able to sell these, but there's a ton of them. That's what's crazy about storage units. Is you, you never know. Watches, Rolex, cigars. We got like crystal, and then boom, you got a bunch of first aid kits. So, anyways, it's crazy. Let's see what's in here. Is it the actual glass? Let's see. He bought this for two bucks. It's in there. Oh yeah. So the glasses are in there. And we have crystal champagne glasses. He paid two bucks for, he or she. All right, let's go on to the next box. The last box of this video. And then we have one more video coming out Tuesday, guys, with another 25 boxes from the same exact storage unit right over there. So this is video number one. So if you haven't watched the actual footage of the storage unit, go there. This is video number one. Then we'll have video number two, box by box. Boom, last box of this video, guys. We have some jeans. Uh, which is kind of cool. So. Oh, 
That's the dog that escaped. Can you guys hear him? We have, we have South Pole. Zorro. And um, another some more jeans. All right guys, we have a bunch of these. They don't have anything in them, but it's basically where you put your coins. So we'll sell those. I think this is an old one here. I think this is an old one. Let's see, oh yep. Another case, guys, another old case that's empty. Another bag, nothing in the bag. Yep, nothing in the bag. We have a cuckoo clock, but it's broken. <laughs> it was in the uh, video. It's actually made in Germany, but it was broken. These are really cool. I'll lock these up. They're sealed. Um, they're sealed. Not open, guys. Here's another coin case. Nothing in here. But that's cool. Flight guide, airport manual. So, uh oh, battery's gonna die. All right, that's about it, guys. That's about it. Just a bunch of papers in here. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Subscribe right below. We have a ton more storage units we're doing. We did uh, six storage units in the last two weeks, which is crazy. So talk to you soon, guys. And so hopefully you have an amazing, amazing day. See ya.